Uh, Sheikh, I have read two hadiths. One is that we cannot publicize our sins. Uh, we should not boast about that we have committed a sin. And then the other hadith says that those who sin in private, when they come to Allah on Judgment Day, they, he will uh, he will destroy their good deeds or something like this. Sheikh. Sheikh, so my point is, we either sin publicly or we sin privately. So both ways, we I, I, I don't run, understand, Sheikh. The first hadith relates to boasting about your sins. Kullu ummati mu'afa illa al-mujahirin. So to go and publicize your sins and boast about it takes you out of those who are forgiven by default because you did not conceal your sin. The other hadith you're referring to, the hadith of Thawban, may Allah be pleased with him, the most authentic opinion is that this hadith is related to hypocrites, not to normal sinners. Because the hadith clearly states that they have the same language, they look like us, they behave like us, but when they are alone with the sins of Allah, they indulge in it without paying any attention that Allah is watching them. Allah would make their good deeds that they've done publicly to fool others and to make them think that they are like them. Allah would make their good deeds in vain. So the most authentic opinion is that this hadith is related to full-fledged hypocrites, not to sinners like you and me who may sin in private and do this while still afraid of Allah, not boasting about it between themselves and happy for doing it, that no one is watching them, disregarding Allah's watching them and holding them to account. So these are two different things, Akhi, and Allah knows best.